Welcome back to our IB Physics video series. This is the second and final video in IB Physics Topic 3, Thermal Physics, where we will be looking at thermal energy, temperature and heat transfer. Before watching this video, ensure you have watched our previous IB Physics Topic 3 video, as this video builds on the concepts introduced there. The principal concept of focus when discussing thermal physics is thermal energy. The thermal energy of an object has various definitions, but the most logical is the total random kinetic energy of all particles in the object, measured in joules. In our previous Topic 3 video, we defined internal energy as total energy of all particles in an object. So, in this context, it can now be redefined as the sum of an object's intermolecular potential energy and its thermal energy. The concept of thermal energy is important when discussing the principle of heat. This is defined as the thermal energy transferred from one object to another, measured in joules, naturally flowing from hot objects to cold objects. Movement in this way is also referred to as heat transfer, altering the temperature of objects. But how is thermal energy related to temperature? Temperature is defined as the average kinetic energy of all particles in an object, measured in Kelvin. Before discussing the relationship to thermal energy, we will explore what a Kelvin is and how it relates to Celsius. The Kelvin scale is considered an absolute scale of temperature, meaning zero Kelvin is the coldest possible temperature, i.e. absolute zero. This is different to Celsius, a relative scale, wherein zero Celsius is the melting point of water and the coldest possible temperature is minus 273 degrees Celsius. Questions might give you a temperature in Celsius or Kelvin, so you need to be comfortable with interconverting them. So, to convert to Kelvin from Celsius, add 273, and to convert to Celsius from Kelvin, subtract 273. As you may have noticed, Kelvin and Celsius are just offset scales. So in questions where a temperature change of 20 degrees is described, Remember that this is also a temperature change of 20 Kelvin. Since temperature is the average kinetic energy and thermal energy is a total kinetic energy, it follows that the temperature of an object is related to its thermal energy. In an ideal gas, the average kinetic energy per particle can be calculated from the temperature using the Boltzmann constant, equal to 1.38 times 10 to the minus 23 joules per Kelvin. The equation is average kinetic energy equals 3 divided by 2 times the Boltzmann constant times by temperature. The Boltzmann constant is actually the ratio of the gas constant to Avogadro's number. So the Boltzmann constant can be replaced such that the equation becomes average kinetic energy equals 3 times the gas constant times temperature divided by 2 times Avogadro's number. So you know all about temperature, but how does this all relate to heat transfer? You've now reached the end of the preview for this IB Science video. If you want to check out the full video, head over to our website and select a membership plan today.